An appeals court in New York has overturned Harvey Weinstein's rape conviction from 2020, which means there could be a new trial and women who say they were victims of Weinstein could have to testify all over again. It's a ruling that has left even Weinstein's team surprised. Weinstein has been serving a 23-year sentence convicted of rape and criminal sexual acts. It's a trial with notoriety, a movie even being made about the New York Times bombshell investigation into the movie producer, compiling a list of more than 100 victims and detailed sexual abuse allegations that would spark the Me Too movement. Hi. We're from the New York Times. I believe you used to work for Harvey Weinstein. This is bigger than Weinstein. This is about the system protecting abusers. The jury was convinced, but the appeals court ruled four to three that jurors could have been wrongfully influenced by women who testified against Weinstein who were not part of the case. And the court says the judge had allowed for allegations unrelated to the charges in cross-examination. The appeals court ruling Weinstein was seen in a highly prejudicial light. In one of the court's dissenting opinions, a judge says this court has continued a disturbing trend of overturning jury's guilty verdicts in cases involving sexual violence. A spokesperson for Weinstein said they were happily surprised and thrilled with the court's decision. Even though Weinstein's conviction has been overturned, doesn't mean the 72-year-old is a free man. He was also convicted in California for sex offenses in 2022, where he was sentenced to 16 years in prison. The New York Appeals Court decision does mean he'll be transferred to the custody of prison authorities in California, while Manhattan District Attorney Alvin Bragg weighs whether to retry the case in a New York courtroom.